Hey all you cool cats and kittens, it's Emily here from Emily Jane FX. Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you want to see this uh, crazy half tiger, half Joe Exotic makeup, then keep watching. If you haven't seen it, this is from the new series on Netflix, Tiger King. So to start off with, I went into this foundation that's way too orange for my skin because his skin's a bit more tanned than mine and I covered half my face in it and I went down my neck as well. I then went into this cream contour palette and I started to kind of turn my face into his and I did this by making my chin a bit smaller and adding wrinkles and basically just from looking at a few different pictures of him um, I made the nose a bit more upturned um, I contoured the face, add wrinkles under the eyes and on the forehead and just generally studied the picture of him and just really tried to turn my face into his using this cream colour I then when I'd finished that I went over with a translucent powder I then saw this eyeshadow which was the perfect shade for his skin tone because he's got quite red skin and I applied that like blusher to the cheeks and also all around the face and neck. I then went into a brown eyeshadow and I just started to deepen the wrinkles that I'd put on with the cream colour and just add more details to make my face look like his. I also went into a white eyeshadow and put that in between the wrinkles and that makes it look a bit more realistic and areas that you want to stand out you can put white eyeshadow on. I then tried to turn my eyebrows into his and his go up a lot higher than mine so I changed the shape and added a moustache with the eyeshadow. I then wanted to replicate this picture I've seen of him with like a blue uh, sparkly jacket on so I just sponged on a few different shades of blue paint and I went into purple and silver on the arms and then using a the black paint I painted the tiger stripes in. I also added some glitter at the end as well. I painted a tiger tattoo on his chest, sorry it was hard for me to film that and I also painted on a necklace that he is wearing in the picture. Okay so then I went onto the tiger side and I sponged white paint coming from the corner of the eye right up and also sponged along the neck and down and around the mouth as well. I then went into this orange shade and I sponged that in all the areas that were left. Made the tiger a bit more interesting, I sponged on some yellow highlights and then I went into a red eyeshadow and I added some shading with that as well. I then started to paint in my tiger stripes and I did this with a black paint and I wiggled the line around and then I also went in with the paint and painted little flicks coming out of the stripes to make it look a bit more like fur and then at the end I also went in with the black eyeshadow just to create a bit of a blurred fur effect. To create the division in the two sides of the face, I painted a wiggly line down the centre. On the side with Joe's face, I highlighted with a white colour and on the tiger face, I shaded in black and that creates this 3D effect.
Okay guys, this is the finished look. It made me laugh so much and I'm sure if we're ever allowed out of the house again, lots of people this year for Halloween are going to dress up as Joe Exotic. If you haven't seen The Tiger King on Netflix, I really recommend watching it. it it's very entertaining. So thank you for watching this tutorial. I hope you enjoyed it. Please give me a thumbs up and subscribe and I'll see you all very soon. Bye. That dame Carol Baskin.